Ricky Dow Castro uh, told me that I was CIA. And I told him that the only CIA I know were Catholic Irish alcoholics. And he thought that was very funny and laughed for quite a bit. So that was my my part of my relationship with him. It was very very little time. Outside of translating for him when he arrived in Havana. I met Pierre Castro summer of 48. I was introduced by his brother-in-law, Raphael. Uh, Cuba was, uh, Havana was only uh, 90 miles away and every newspaper in the United States could afford to send someone. So it was a madhouse. There were American correspondents from just about every every paper in the country. And I was there. So Fidel said to me, Hey, this is this is insanity. Help me out. So I stepped up and uh, helped them with the press, the translation. That's about all I did. I, I was hoping that uh, there would be democracy and freedom like there was there only eight years before. And then, in fact, uh, everybody was. So, but so Castro, Castro was really the big betrayer. He double crossed all those who had been with him, especially the youth. They, they uh, helped oust the Batista. And uh, Castro said, betrayed him by becoming a dictator. The Pope goes to Cuba in September. I would like to be invited to go with the bishop to see him. Uh, 